Hey, what's up you guys? Today we are going to be reviewing another Boohoo haul. Um, so I liked it so much the first time around that I was like, hey, I'll give it a try again. So I mainly went for like my summer vibe. So rompers, things like that. Uh, there's like a pair of shoes. Um, and this video was supposed to happen so long ago. Um, but there was an issue. The packages took forever to arrive, which is understandable in the time of COVID. Um, but they took forever to arrive. And then once the second one finally got here, I was like, hmm, there's like five pieces missing. So I emailed the company. Uh, they were like, oh, whoops, our bad, sorry. Um, and they were out of two of the pieces that were supposed to come. So they just refunded me for those items and sent the rest to here. So we finally have all of it. I hope I actually haven't opened the third bag, but we're hoping for the best. Um, anyway, let's get started. So let's start with this bag, which is the parcel that arrived, this, the second parcel that arrived, but had the things missing. So it only had one thing in it. And it is the most glorious. Okay, so I'm, my vibe since like Stranger Things season three came out has been like 80s mom vibes, um, or just like mom vibes, but like, not like, a, like a mom mom, you know, like a cool mom. Anyway, yes. So I got this <laughs> jean jumpsuit <laughs> and here I'll stand up so you guys can see. It's, um... It's a jean jumpsuit, full on, full straight up. Look at that. That is amazing. I am so excited to try this on. Um, and I got this. Okay, so the thing I was trying to explain last time about the sizing chart. Hey guys, it's uh, editing Caitlin. So apparently I've explained that sizing chart wrong twice. Um, so the sizing chart is in small, medium, and large, and then when you go to order the clothes, they are in numbered sizes. Um, so that's the confusing part, but there it is. That is explained the right way. There you go. Bye. Um, but that is what I was trying to explain last video, and I don't think I did it very well. But anyway, that's our first piece. Now, it does feel very well made. Like, this is, this is jean. This is nice thick jean. So this was one of the more expensive items and it was $26.10. Now I did uh, have a few promo codes for my order. Um, I think they'd sent me one for my birthday. So everything's a little, little discounted. You know what I mean? That's how we like it. So let's go try it on. Here's the jumpsuit. I think it is super cute. I think I might have been able to go down a size because I've kind of got this uh, gap right here. But other than that, it fits pretty great. I kind of like almost that it's a little bit loose so it's not like clung to my body. Um, but I think this is super cute for just like hanging around, you know, going out, just chilling, not have to worry that much. Like... The only problem I foresee with this are these buttons because these buttons are like real buttons so you have to like do that. So every time you have to pee you're going to have to undo all these buttons and then, and then it's going to be a whole thing. So that is the only problem I foresee with this but other than that I think it is super duper cute. It does hit the tops of my feet so it's definitely long enough but I think it is super cute so it's a thumbs up. All right, next up is the actual first parcel that arrived. Oh, oh, there's a potato head in it. Sorry. I got these bags before I moved, except for the last bag, and so moving's crazy. You can see all the boxes behind me. It's literally just been a mess, but yeah. So anyway, out of our next parcel, here is our first item. It is, oh yes, cute. Okay, so it's this little romper. Well, I don't know how to get the uh, color to show up correctly, 
but it's this really, really light rosy pink, um, which I swear it's coming up gray on the camera and I don't know how to fix it. Like there's, I've got like the window open, there's light, I have my lighting, I don't know what's wrong. <laughs> but anyway, I'm sorry, I'll try to color correct, but I don't know how. Um, but yeah, so it's this really nice pink. I'm sorry you guys can't see the color very well, but yes. For this romper, I paid $13.93 and it's called the Loop Back Puff Sleeve Romper. So it sounded interesting. Here is this romper. I think it is super cute. Now this is a size eight. So I think I got the perfect size. Um, it is adorable. I love this little piece in the back. It's very comfy. Um, it's got these nice like elastic puff sleeves. I think it's super cute. I wish it had pockets. I love pockets. But otherwise, I think this is going to be great for just kind of lounging around the house. So thumbs up. Our next item is this jean romper. It's really frilly at the top and at the legs. And it's got the str like the straps that go down on your shoulders like this does, uh, but it also has the straps like up here to like actually hold it up, which is what I was so excited about because anytime you get something strapless, it's just gonna continually fall down and fall down. But this can be cute and it'll hold up. And for this, I paid $17.41. So I'm really excited to try this on. It feels very well made. It's definitely not as thick as the jean jumpsuit, but it is still um, a pretty thick jean. It's just like thinner than the jumpsuit, but it seems very well made and let's go try it on. Okay, we're gonna talk about this for a second because I don't know if it's cute or not. I don't, I don't know if this is flattering on me, but here are the issues. So getting it on, <laughs> Okay, first, no, let's talk about that issue. These straps, I have them literally to the tightest setting and like, they, they like, you'd have to bring this down so far for these to even be tight. They're like attached to these and not like the actual romper. So I don't know why they're there because like at that point they don't really have a purpose and you ha you just have to like keep hiking this down to even make them tighter like the straps are just like overly too big like completely um also getting it over my hips was a nightmare like it's elastic and like once it's on like now that it's on it's fine except for the straps of course but like this part would not stretch at all. Like getting it over, I literally had to sit there and just like hop. Like, and this one is a US six, but the thing is, is that if you were to go bigger, like these straps would still be a problem. So not my favorite, probably not gonna keep it. If you like it, let me know down below, but I just, I have too many issues with this and it's just not cute enough for the hassle. So this one gets a thumbs down. Sorry, boohoo. Next up is probably another romper. Um, it is, all right. So this is a little like utility romper. Uh, it's got lots of pockets. It's kind of got like that uh, mechanic suit sort of vibe to it. Um, it's very pretty. It's this nice kind of matte uh, soft gray, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, but it's very pretty. I know it looks maybe a little bit greeny on screen. Um, it might be a little bit of a green gray, but it's definitely this very nice matte green or uh, light gray. And for this, I paid $17.41. So let's go try it on. Okay, so this romper is super cute. I love all of the pockets and that they are real pockets. Um, my only issue is I think I probably could have sized down one. It's a little gaffy up here. I might exchange it and get a size lower, but as of right now, like, it's fine. It's just, it's a little gaffy, you know? And like, this is not where you want it to gaff at all. So I'm probably gonna get the size down, but I do think that it is super cute. I 
love this. This is like perfect. So I hope they have one in a size down so I can exchange it, but I love this. This is super cute. So this is a US size eight. So I think I probably needed the six in this, but I was kind of worried that the six was gonna be too small because I didn't think this fabric was gonna be as stretchy as it was. But yeah, so it's super cute, but I'm probably gonna size down. So I'm going to give it a thumbs up on cuteness and a middle on sizing. <laughs> I have lip gloss on. Next, we have a, another sort of utility romper, except this one is a super bright green. It's this super cool neon green. I think it's super fun, you know, and it's got this nice, uh, like, belt for it. So, yeah. And for this, I paid $21.76. Now, it's definitely not the color of the picture. That one I know for sure. Um, I know I'm, I'll throw the pictures up for them, but this in the picture looked like a neon, like it almost looked yellow, like it looked bright. Um, and while this is still super pretty and I'm super excited about it, it is definitely not the color in the picture. So yeah, let's go try it on. Okay, so here is our green romper. Um, I think it's super cute. I love the pockets right here and then up here. I think this belt is cute. Um, sizing wide, it's a size 8, uh, US 8, but it's definitely not the same 8 as the other one. This kind of goes to show you how, like, sizing can completely vary from piece to piece, whereas the last size 8 was a bit too big. This one is pretty much just right. Um, it might be, like, the teens, teensiest bit, bit too tight, but just around, like, right here, so... I lose a little weight, it'll go away, it'll fit perfect, perfect. Um, but otherwise, like, it fits great. I think it is super cute, super fun, just kind of chill around, you know, cute, but like casual, you know, you know, you feel me? So this gets a big thumbs up. All right, up next, we have the lamest thing I bought this haul, which is just a pair of sweatpants. <laughs> because I really like sweatpants, you know? I like being comfy. Um, and these just looked so perfect. They're joggers, they got a little thing at the bottom. They are super thick. Like these feel really well made. Um, the inside is sort of like that nice, really soft felty material. And then the outside of course is like sweatpants. Um, so I'm super excited. And for these, I paid $13.93, so not bad, and I'm so excited. Let's go try them on. So I've got the camera angled down a little bit so you can see, it, but these are the sweatpants. I really like them. I think they are really soft and really comfy, but also like really stretchy, and they're like, I don't know. It's weird because they're like tight here, then like only semi tight here and then of course tight at the bottom so I don't know if they're like flattering or whatever but they're sweatpants so they're comfortable which means that they're better they're just laying around the house sweatpants so I really like them the tag said they were a size 10 so I don't know I think their conversions really weird but I like these I think they're comfortable thumbs up okay last is the bag that came today so hopefully everything is in it that we should be getting um so we've got this what is this this is a dress okay yes so this is a little um smock dress i think it was called um, but for this, I paid $17.41. Now, in the picture, it looks more like a linen -y material, um, whereas this is almost like, um, it's that weird fancy crepe paper material. Whatever that sucker fabric is. So, let's go try this on. All right, so this one's pretty simple. Um, it definitely fits different than I expected it would. Also, this ruffle it like goes down and then up, which is weird. I don't see why they didn't have it the same length, but okay. <laughs> it's kind of a weird fit the way it is. So like the sleeves are like really nice and loose. 
this is like stretched across so this is more like tight but then it just kind of like falls down <laughs> I don't know it's really weird I've never had a smock dress before maybe that's how they're supposed to be I do think it is really pretty um it's a little bit shorter I guess than I would usually get a dress I don't know maybe it's just today but I think it's really cute I think with like a little belt or something it could be extra cute um so I definitely will be keeping this one it fits it looks cute I'm happy thumbs up next up in this bag we have something other pretty basic but actually not that basic um it's just a pair of jeans but not just any kind of jeans okay these is some wide jeans okay I don't know about y'all but I own a lot of skinny jeans like most of my jeans are like that weird jegging material because I like them to be stretchy but also I just it's hard to find good jeans that are loose but also look good <laughs> um I feel like they just kind of drown me out sometimes but these are the mid-rise distressed boyfriend jeans um and they are 20 176 2176 is what I paid um it's a size Okay, hmm. I'm curious if these are gonna fit or not because it says US size 2, but it's a UK size 6. I don't know about y'all. I ain't no size 2 in the US. These puppies were definitely a US size 2 because they could not get over my thighs. Like, they got to my thighs and they were like, mm mm, we're out. So, I'm really disappointed about that. I don't know if there was just some sort of mix-up or what it is um, because I definitely ordered a size 6. Um, but it's, like I said, the, the sizing is just super weird on the website because they have small, medium, and large in the size guide and then actual numbers when you have to buy the clothes. I don't know. And last but not least, I had to get a pair of shoes, of course, just to make sure we rounded out everything. And these are some chunky trainers. I don't know about y'all, but I am loving the chunky shoe trend. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I love it. I love giant tennis shoes because they're so comfy for one and also like you can just do whatever in them. Like they're there. Um, but I think these are so cute. They've got this neon orange and yellow and this nice blue on them. I think they are so cute. Um, and they say 40 in them, but I know I got a US size 9, paid $21.76. Um, so we'll have to try them on. But not least are these shoes. I think they are super cute. They fit perfect. I think they definitely need some sort of like insert in them because they aren't like too comfortable sole wise. But I think they are so cute. I feel like they make me taller. And yeah, I'm really happy with these. They get a thumbs up. This haul was not as amazing as our last haul, but I guess that does go to show you how how each one is different. Each piece is its own little person personality. Um, and it's gonna fit completely different depending on your body and how it was sized, so. It is what it is. I'm really, really happy about the things that did fit and the things I will be keeping. Um, and I will be trying to exchange the ones that didn't fit and didn't work. But yeah, so all over, I am pretty happy. Um, even though this haul wasn't as great as the last one, I still think I got some really cute pieces out of it. And I can't really blame Boohoo because it, it, it was just, you know, a, a size issue and I'm the one that ordered the sizes um, except for the pants I don't know what was going on with those pants <laughs> I don't know why they gave me a US size 2 but whatever um, but yeah so tell me what you guys thought about this haul if there are any pieces that you particularly liked let me know in the comments down below also be sure to let me know of any other clothing makeup product pretty much anything you would like me to test on this channel just Put it down below in the comments and I will do my very best to get to it. I do have some other um, clothing and makeup videos coming soon. I'm just waiting on shipping and things are crazy, you know. 
So, but yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. Please be sure to smash that like button and subscribe for more of my content. Um, and yeah, so love you guys. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.